great, great, you know, the, the days of GG, really meaning GG, right. are, are, are kind of behind us, it seems. So what we always have to do is realize that for all 10 of you that say something really, really negative in this chat, one person's going to go, hey, dude, that's great, thanks. And that's the guy that we care about. That's right. Because you all bitch about everything. And I bitch about everything. This game sucks. Ah, it's laggy. Ah, I'm, I'm disconnecting. What the hell? So it's our nature to be kind of more critical than the average human right. being, I think. Um, I so guess, thick skin is a, a, a much You needed. have to have a thick skin, you know, and the, the bottom line is, is that we do this because literally we care. We are gamers. I mean, we're not sitting here getting billions of dollars for doing this. No. I, you know, we've spent a lot of money and we do it because A, we love what we do. You have to do that. Yep. B, I would be unhappy doing anything else, right? Uh, yeah, I can't even think about it. <laughs> but C, it's really because we enjoy, you know, when we asking questions to people that are standing right there and we know that these people were unable to attend, to me, that's that's worth it, you know? Yeah, and I think, like, like I call this live TV. Right. It, we, you are producing live TV. The same gear you yeah. use sits in Fox Sports Trucks. Exactly. So the quality is there. You just happen to be putting your product over yeah. the internet. Which, by the way, more people can see. Absolutely. Absolutely. And, and someone asks, like, what's the most stressful thing? And uh, I think where he sits is the most stressful thing in the production. Yeah. DJ Wheat might differ, but they're so good at what they do that them talking all day is not a big deal. But, like, right. he controls what you see, what you hear, if it's good or bad, the internet. It gets very, very stressful right here. Right. Um, so, to me, that's the stress. They want to know where oh, your goatee oh, is. Wow, projections, you know me. I shaved my wow. goatee like a year ago. Wow. wow. Yeah. Yeah, you didn't have it at Blizzard. I was trying to make it look, right me look like I was more like 40 instead of 43. Is it working out? I don't it's know. working. I wouldn't have guessed you're 40. 43, yeah. But other than the gray, do you look at this. I got gray hair in my beard. You do have some gray hair. I got gray and I'm losing it. It's not very cool. Okay, now it's just turned into a totally old man show. Uh, would, you say, would you guys say there's more specific skill set needed to be in the production side of gaming business, post-secondary education, internships, and post level? Um, that's a good question. I would think if if some I, maybe I'm confused by the question like after gaming in the real production or using real production skills in gaming. Uh, I think he's saying uh, specific skill set needed. Okay, yeah. uh, not necessarily a skill set. Like everything I everything I learned about this gear that Shane uses, I was self taught. Right. Bought the gear, learned it. It's very intuitive. I mean, there's all different gear, but I was too. I have a degree in computer science, but I knew nothing about production. There, nothing. Yeah, and I didn't either. Other than like I had done some stuff in college and high school and messed right. around with cameras, but like no, and I I didn't even inspire to do it. But I I at the time that we started Godfrag TV. We looked at who else was doing it, and I was with Gottfrag, a very large print news organization, and it was a natural progression to us. So we just jumped right in. Um, I had uh, some friends that had a, a, a VT, which is similar to the TriCaster, that kind of knew how to use it, so showed me, but just you got to jump in and do it. Right. Um, I would say of anything in gaming, other than if you were a game developer, like in our side of the neck of the woods, anybody who walks in with any sort of audiovisual uh, experience, like you went to school or at college, instantly helps because you you know all the terms you know um, and you could sit down right where Shane's sitting and start switching a show so that right. those kind of things are, are definitely lean towards it and quite the opposite I know some guys that used to work for Marcus at CGS that started just doing the, the, the little stuff and are now doing real production work in LA so they went right. the opposite they went from doing little gaming kind of grassrooty stuff to like the big cameras the big shows the big trucks so it goes both ways so unlike a, you yeah Oh, wait, no. No, yeah. no, no. So uh, we will see. There was a question in the chat room. Do we get mad when we're sitting here all day and all these games are around us? <laughs> um, well, again, I, I've been lucky to not have to sit at a trade show like this and not, like, the, the stuff I do is competitive-based. So while I don't get to see all the boosts, I get to see some of the greatest pro gamers playing each other, and I got the best seat in the house, and I can take right. different camera angles that no one else sees. You know how that goes. Right. So I, I don't get bummed out. Um, now you you got I I'm working with robotic cameras. Do you have robotic yeah, cameras? Okay. I have three. Have you ever zoomed in on chicks on the preview window and they don't know you're watching? Oh, we'll, we'll yeah. do that later. We'll do that later. <laughs> we'll I, you know. <laughs> you watched Devastation. That that private camera went public had a many stalker times. Cam. Stalker cameras. Swoozy yeah. stalker cam. Yeah, Swoozy stalker um, cam. But at BlizzCon, I had quite a few preview only shots. Put right. it that way. We have a bad girl over here that the guys are absolutely. Yeah, they keep screaming about bad girl. I'm what is that? You. I'll show you. Let me okay. show you. See on the preview let's get bad window. Girl. Let's get bad girl. Where's she at? Oh, I see where you're going. Oh wait, where's she at? Uh, she may have left. Oh, there she is. I found her. 
Oh, yeah, yeah you should take that shot. Yeah, let's There's take that Bad shot. Girl, okay. That is Bad Girl. They've been, they look, the, watch the chat room. Oh, blow she's up. really cool. Here it comes. Watch the chat room. Show us. Here it comes. Is yeah, she working the Blizzard booth in front of us? Is that no, what she's, she's doing? No, she's right here oh, in the next in now. front. Yeah. Oh, th this booth, yeah. Look at it. Bad here girl. it comes, see? Yeah. So, yeah, they've been all about the Bad Girl all day long, so. I kind of feel bad because here we are putting on this live I know. show. Well, oh, now she's jumping. Now she's jumping, jumping, that? bad girl. Oh, we jumping can't. bag. See, I show up and she jumps. Scoots, we can't compete with that. Oh, whatever. She's no Becky. True, Becky is standing right That's in front true. of me, and bad Becky's girl right here. does not hold a candle to Becky. Although Becky could hold herself to me if she wanted to. That's true. I can oh, she can't hear that. me, can she? I, I might be able to. <laughs> we never know. We should we should just do because we can't compete with bad girl. We should just do something like you know picture in picture over or something. There you go. Like Give we us should a little. Just be like right there. There you go. So that way you get to still see bad like girl reach, and see and reach see, over towards bad girl. Like, we can't past compete you. with that. I'm telling yeah. you. The guy. The bad guy, girl's making faces now. The the guy's telling her that he's on she's on camera. I think so. Anyways. Hey, there's fish sticks. Hey, fish sticks. I'm at PAX. Are you here? You jerk. It's, it's probably like. So I had a couple guys that. Yeah. I said I was coming to PAX last minute, and I tweeted that I was looking for badges, right? Apparently, these gentlemen don't know me too well, because they were basically like, dude, PAX is in two days. It's sold out. There's no way in hell you're going to get badges. It won't happen. It won't happen. Right. To a point where one guy wanted to bet me. And I'm like, dude, trust really? me. I will get badges. I know people. I got sponsors. I'll get badges. So oh, hell yeah. It was very easy to get a badge. Oh, wait. Wait. Show Even it again. Fish Sticks. Fish Show Sticks in chat. Show your badge. Even Fish Sticks is like, dude, you, you're not going to be able to get a badge, dude. Hey, but I got one up on you. But you, got, you got VIP? Okay, hold on. Show your badge. You got Exhibitor. I just got badge. Exhibitor. Steel Series. Check that out. Is that VI? Oh, Media. Okay. Okay, now wait. I got That's one good. up on you, right? Watch this. I got two badges. Enforcer? What's the Enforcer badge, dude? That means I run shit around here. Wow. Well, see, I'm not working. I don't get no Enforcer. No, but you know, let impressive. me tell you the story. So let me tell you the story how it works. Because we have a booth, nice. but we're not an Exhibitor, we couldn't come in early to set up. Ah. But they, they didn't want to give us exhibitor badges because we're not really exhibitors. Makes so sense. So they give these to the enforcers, which are the people that are running. like They're like the little police that run around here. So we all have enforcer and media badges. So no one hassles you because the exactly. media will only get you so far and then that gets you enforcer everywhere. Gets That's cool. This, That's very it's cool. It's like the key to the city at PAX. Nicely done. Know? So, yeah, it's cool. They're taking care of us at PAX. Uh, good show. I'm really having a good time, and I just got here last night. Tomorrow, I think, will be, like I said, be nuts with people. Did you see this? Let me take this shot. Oh, this. Master Chief's in the house. Look at that. Look okay, at that. so I walked by him earlier, and I was trying to figure out if he was kind of a paid guy to be walking around, or if this guy made the Ute costume, like spent all year, and came here to walk around. I, and I couldn't know. figure it out because I didn't ask him. That, it's impressive. Jeremy. I mean, Jeremy. You Jeremy. should interview. Get him over here instead of me. Interview Master Chief instead of me. He's way cooler. He's way cooler than me. Oh, he's not cooler than you. Oh, of course he is. I mean, he's cool, but you're Sir Scoots. I mean, well, you know, he's he's imitating a cool guy. That's true. That's you true. are a cool guy. Well, I don't know. I don't know about that. I hang out with cool people. I don't know how cool I am. Give him the mic. Too. Am I done? Am I out here? No, no. You're gonna stay right. here just for a second. Can he talk through there? Let's see if he can talk. Can he? Okay. Why the haven't they bottom. not closed us out of here? It's not six. We don't close at six today. No, I guess not. What time? It was seven. Close? I thought. Is it seven? Seven. I think that seven. would explain why we're not running us out of here. Hey, I'm not. You guys are the one working the show. I'm just hanging out. What's up? Hi, Becky. How are you? Hi, very nice to you. I'm good. I'm good. All right, real quick. Let's All say right. goodbye to Sir Scoots because I don't know how long this interview is going to take. Scoots, man, it is an absolute Absolutely. pleasure. Um, Thanks for having me. Man, thank you for having us. And so chat, tell anybody for about any projects that you got going on, that you, any, any shows. Obviously, Epileptic Gaming on UStreamTV.com. You guys can check out Marcus. Yep. Um, he does the um, mutton, or what is it? Um, Call It and Brawl. Call It and Brawl. Best bet is just to go to www.djweet.tv. Yep. Uh, we basically have currently three shows going right now. We're thinking about doing some others. We're thinking about uh, moving our stuff around some. Um, also, I run Team Evil Geniuses, a professional uh, pro gaming team. So that's myeg.net. Um, and, uh, yeah, thanks for the support. Obviously, keep supporting UFRAG and what Shane and Gang are doing here. Uh, you can't do it if people don't watch. And uh, so, right. yeah. Check them out love. on Twitter, www.twitter.com forward slash Sir Scoot. So, Beautiful. thanks, man. I appreciate Peace. it. Thank you, man. All right, let's go over to Master Chief real quick. And uh, we'll get Jeremy with Master Chief. 